everyone, this is uh, Bartosz Beda here recording from my studio in uh, Dallas, uh, Texas. As you can tell uh, behind me, uh, I've been working uh, in the studio for a while now. Uh, this is uh, my new painting that I started uh, today and I'll be continuing, continuing working on it uh, tonight, certainly. Uh, last uh, couple of weeks, uh, no, maybe last two weeks, um, I've been, I was uh, painting and throwing away uh, canvases and also uh, repainting whatever I painted. So I had a little bit of, uh, I had a little bit of uh, moment uh, in the last two weeks uh, where nothing really uh, that I created uh, was good, at least in my eyes, maybe in yours too. So. Um, uh, I just decided not to uh, pursue it uh, further, but I'm hoping that uh, today I have some type of uh, breakthrough, maybe a subject matter that I just uh, came across uh, and uh, finally um, uh, drives me in to paint more, so we'll see. I am drinking uh, uh, my coffee, this is the uh, 8 uh, cup uh, of the coffee. Uh, more you drink, uh, the better you should uh, feel, but actually it's quite opposite. I don't feel much energy right now and uh, uh, I feel like to, I feel like uh, more coffee doesn't really help, so maybe I should uh, try something stronger. No, just kidding. If we can, of course, uh, call uh, drinking coffee addiction, I don't know, maybe it is a form of addiction, just like uh, smoking or, um, I don't know, doing other silly things. Um, but painting is also my addiction, you know, it's my passion, but also it's a form of uh, addiction. And also today um, I discovered um, that on YouTube, um, in your profile, uh, on the phone profile, you can actually see how many hours uh, uh, a day, a week you spend uh, watching uh, videos on the YouTube. And uh, I find out today that I've been watching uh, this week, no last week, sorry, because today is uh, Wednesday, so that's for the last week. I was I spent uh, 10 hours on uh, YouTube uh, watching that content. It's uh, not necessarily me only sitting and watching it. It's uh, in most uh, uh, cases uh, uh, listening or watching while I'm painting or doing something in the studio. But still, it's quite a bit of uh, content that I uh, consume and I 
think that uh, that's uh, one of the things that maybe uh, stop me to be even more productive and uh, successful. Watching uh, videos on the YouTube uh, can be a quite good thing if uh, I can learn something new from it. I also was uh, listening to the NPR uh, a couple weeks ago and they were actually talking about uh, people who think that by watching videos uh, on how to make things um, uh, they actually learn uh, making those things but when it comes to actually executing it uh, in uh, real life they actually struggle a lot so learning by trying and in that way mistakes maybe it's uh, way better than just uh, looking at things and thinking that uh, you understand it while trying it uh, afterward or not trying at all but however I have to say that uh, you know that's not only the case um, we have to learn something first to or we have to get to know something first to uh, be able to uh, put it into work so you know just uh, me talking I don't know doesn't maybe um, it doesn't really make uh, maybe much sense but anyway so this is the painting that I'm working on right now as you can see this is my palette and uh, those uh, two paintings I'm, I'm going to repaint them I'm not really happy with them I don't know they could be a good uh, paintings but at the end I think that uh, it's not something that I want to pursue I don't want to waste my, my energy and time but I'm going to reuse uh, already existing canvas and paint and uh, repaint it now, you know I already have that background that uh, color skin and then I can twist it uh, change it and uh, make something a little bit more exciting so I'm looking forward to that and uh, uh, meanwhile not meanwhile this is the goal for today I hope I can actually uh, finish this painting in 80% uh, tonight um, partially it's important for me to finish a painting in one session maximum two sessions because I'm not patient enough to uh, stick to the painting for a long time if I uh, stick to the painting uh, too long then I overpaint it I come up with new ideas and I want to change too much so keeping the painting fresh and keeping it uh, the way I like and I want want it to look um, the best way to achieve that I need to keep it uh, in a short uh, sessions or one long session um, to define the painting surface uh, texture color skin and finish the painting in uh, that one day that one session it's uh, very crucial for my practice
just uh, said about uh, painting in my session actually uh, align with certain uh, things and let me think about my painting schedule if I keep it short or keep it a little bit too a little bit longer it, it seems uh, working for me but once I uh, jump into the longer session sessions and expand my uh, time of uh, finishing the painting that's the moment when I um, lose that freshness and that ability to finish the painting uh, in the way that uh, I plan it at the beginning I consume at that point too much of the painting too much of the problems uh, um, on the canvas with texture, paint, color, uh, subject matter, everything kind of aligning itself on one level and too much thoughts, too much uh, uh, consumption of uh, uh, the process does not allow me to uh, be uh, productive and uh, finish it in the way that the painting look fresh and great so um, that could be one of the things why lately and last two weeks uh, I was not progressing enough with uh, new paintings um, those kind of uh, moments when uh, I spend too much time overthinking the painting are good as, good as well as I um, through all that overthinking create new ideas and to maybe push myself further with understanding um, what painting is about for me and it helps me with that uh, provides me a new way to understand uh, painting so when I overthink the painting it's like uh, almost like watching too much uh, videos and not uh, doing the right thing with that knowledge that we just uh, consumed from the um, from the screen and um, being able to uh, break that uh, habit uh, in the studio with the painting is something important to me and uh, breaking that addiction of uh, focusing too much on uh, one thing and uh, going back again to my previous um, habits uh, helps me a lot with the pain i don't know if that uh, makes uh, uh, much sense to you i hope it does we all experience all kinds of uh, different habits uh, addictions and consumption consumptions in our life so i hope we can actually see them and break them in that uh, level line and uh, see what's important in it to make that jump to something new new progression uh, new ideas new directions so i'm going to stop here i don't want to talk or over talk too much i feel like i talked already a lot um this is gonna be it for uh, tonight's video um and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Please uh, subscribe and like this video. It will help me a lot to grow my channel. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.